All right, guys, check this out. I'm going to do a little bit of a use my fish eye. It's a 15 millimeter fish eye. I haven't used too much, but I think it worked pretty good here. Anywho, uh, this is a video. It's been a man. It's probably been over a month since I've since I did anything on, uh, you know, give you guys any updates. Been super busy. We're trying to get this one done and one that's in Hawaii right now. Um, got all of January. It took up all my time. Um, waiting on parts and waiting for a, a custom 3D printed nose to come out. And uh, uh, anyways, um, I'll fill you in on that one when, when I get some more pictures. So, um, you know, stay tuned. But this one here uh, finished and it will go to Dennis Baldwin. So stay tuned on his channel and I'll um, keep you guys up to date from my Facebook page and my... Instagram, Twitter, and all those little outlets. So stay tuned. And uh, before I ramble on and tell you more about this, hit the like, uh, uh, like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the uh, go to my Facebook uh, Sweep Wings page, like me over there, and uh, yeah, tell your friends. I'm on Instagram too. So if you find me, it's just whatever the hashtag is and then Sweep Wings. And I should show up somewhere in there. You can see all my progress. So let me fill you in on all this this is the sweep wings juggernaut pathfinder series that i wanted to make for a while let me see if i can focus it but all it is uh, is uh the juggernaut wings with a bigger uh midsection that's taller and wider and because it's taller and wider, I can fit all the goodies in here. And there we go. So we've got the Pixhawk or Fixhawk, depending on what you have, um, or budget is, it can fit. Um, I'm gonna sell these, uh, probably the frames, the fully built frames, not the kits. And uh, keep it basically keep it like this so you can drop your stuff in there it will be a slow process but um you know it's it's basically uh you know just drop your stuff in and and chuck it in the air well don't do that you're gonna you know obviously calibrate everything but i got gps um the compass the po tube over here which is pretty nice so it's it's long enough so you can just Stick it in that way. <laughs> um, we've got your sensor here. Right there. Probably out of focus, but I don't have a, I don't have a camera person. Um, Metal Gear servos that are aluminum casing. You can see that right there. Let's go over here. This one's better. This, uh, the light. There we go. So... Those are the Hextronics. You can get them at Hobby King. Um, ESC is a multi-rotor ESC. You can see it there. And here's the motor. Nothing special. All cheap parts. But it freaking works. And it's awesome. So keep that in mind. Here is the inside. And I gotta get the chair out of my way because it's hitting my foot. Bam, there we go. We got some stuff over there. So that is the 12C uh, plug in here. <clears throat> and focus, finger. Right, there we go. That's a little bit better. And the uh, actual lead is in there, is under here. It's Velcroed underneath. Uh, you got your buzzer, um, memory card, and then your. Uh, micro USB plug that's on the side which this is usually out and then you're gonna plug it in or make a hole or take this thing out and then update it and do all that good stuff and then calibrate it with the radio on and do that stuff so if you're familiar with a pick sock or fix sock you know you'll you'll know the drill but batteries up front uh, some people don't like these uh, these uh, multi-star batteries but mine all came in working nicely and yeah they're all ready to rock uh checked them and they're good the thing is with the stock battery it was heavier 
and the flight time was reduced. To, um, I think I got 57 minutes on the first juggernaut that I had that Dennis Baldwin has. And this is a 5200 milliamp that is actually lighter. And these are three cells, so it's very easy, uh, very easy to use. Got the telemetry over here with the one hell of a tight Velcro um, latch there, locking me mechanism. And there's a two-way telemetry radio. Now the nat actually sl slides in once I get it in focus, um, and then you're gonna bend the antenna. Well, not bend because it has a knuckle on there. You're gonna bend it up and then just fish it up, shove it in there, and you can kind of see it's flush. So that's pretty cool. And then just tuck that to the side. Your camera, get it level. Um, do the Velcro or strap on top. Figure out a way if I have some extra straps or something. Maybe Velcro it or put something in there. I don't know. Got your reset button. Uh, I kind of messed up here. Let's see how short it is. On my Pix or my Fix Hawk, it's actually longer and it worked, but this one was short, so there it is. Um, receiver, right now it's not in the uh, S bus mode. I'm running it regular because I'm going to do a test on it, and then I'll be able to, you know, put all this stuff in there. And bu 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 yeah, that's pretty much it. So, yeah, um, stay tuned. I'm going to try to uh, do some more videos, and I haven't flown in a long time, um, and I really want to. I miss flying, I really do. But these have been, you know, keeping me busy. I have another. Actually, I have. I want to say I have two more mapping frames that I want to do, um, and the FPV frames they've they're actually up here and they they fly perfectly, but I know. I'm getting a ton of emails and uh, PMs with, you know, interest with this. So these are going to be, um, you know, uh, th uh, available through me and the parts and stuff like that will lay out will pretty much be the same. I'm going to try to duplicate it for, um, for you guys just to drop it in. I want to keep this cheap and not so so dang expensive where it leaves everyone out of the market to me i see that it's wrong that you're charging triple the amount of of an airframe you know that's you know that shouldn't be that much so i, I want it to be accessible for everyone um the price on this one's a little bit more than my fully built juggernaut and that's only because i'm a it takes me a long time to do the layout so it takes me a long time. So just heads up with that. And these hands do all the work. I, I Everything is done. You know, I do this all by myself uh, when I get home from work. So um, kids are inside right now. I'm tired. I'm pretty much going to stop here and then go inside and kind of relax. But I wanted to show you guys. So, you know, just understand me. Just understand it takes a long time for me to get this done. And the price, I, I want to keep it very fair. So um, keep that in mind and um, tell your friends and uh, yeah, wood to your mother. Hit the thumbs up, the likes, and uh, check me out on all the other uh, outlets, the social outlets. And I will do my best to keep you up to date on everything. So bam, oh, here's the belly shot. Boom, look at them boobies. <laughs> Anyways, later guys.